Hi guys, I went to go see Insidious. Um, I wasn't planning on going to see it, but Eric made me, so I went. I'm gonna put spoilers like halfway in, so I'll warn you before I start talking about spoilers, but um, for now you're good. Uh, it's about this family, and the mom thinks that their house is haunted, so they change houses, but it turns out that it's not the house that's haunted, it's their son. That's what it's about. Um, it's really scary, uh, I think. I didn't sleep until like 5.30 this morning, and I had my room light on, and it was terrifying. I kept thinking that somebody was going to turn up in the corner of my room. Now I'm going to talk about some spoilers, so you might not want to watch if you haven't seen it. I thought the first half was a lot scarier than the second half. In the first half, you don't really see too much. In the second part, you see very bizarre things, but in the first part, you know, they do show some stuff, but it's kind of like your imagination is still making you see whatever you want to see. So that was scary, and the jumps were scary. There were a lot of, like, jumps and, like, that kind of scare throughout the movie. One of the scariest scenes was when the mom is walking around or whatever in their new house, and all of a sudden the music goes on, like, because she's playing music. Why do they play music in these movies? Like, the, the character. The mom decides to play music on, like, a record player in a new house after you've been haunted. You know it's gonna change to some weird, creepy song when you're not, like, looking. You know it's gonna change. And it did change. It changed to the creepiest song in the world. I think it is the creepiest song in the world. Um, certainly the guy who sings it is the creepiest person I've ever seen in my life. That's Tiny Tim. I'll put a link below so that you can also be scared like me and I won't be alone. The old lady witch thing scared the hell out of me. I've said it before, old ladies freak me out, so they certainly knew what they were doing when they put that in. Seeing the demon devil thing at the end was strange. It wasn't scary. Like, all the stuff at the end where he goes into the further was... Theatrical, very theatrical, and not, it didn't scare me. Like, that stuff doesn't scare me. Um, like, you see him sharpening, like, the stuff, and it's like, this is silly. Rose Byrne um, played the mom, and Patrick Wilson played the dad. And I thought that Rose Byrne was so much better than Patrick Wilson. I am not a Patrick Wilson fan. Um, I don't, like, dislike him or anything, but I just don't ever buy what he's doing. He's not a natural actor at all. Like, he is the most obvious actor. Um, like, it's just, I don't like watching obvious actors who are like, I'm brushing my teeth now and I'm gonna look as casual as I can while I'm brushing my teeth because real people look like this when they brush their teeth, so I'm gonna really try and look like I'm not thinking about it even though in my head I'm really trying to look really normal brushing my teeth. Like, that sort of thing. He just tries too hard and it doesn't come naturally to him. You know, so, I mean, some people disagree and think he was really great and think that she was bad, but I think the total opposite, I thought that she was really natural, um, I believed her, she was, like, just really, really good. So I'm a fan of hers now, but him, no. This movie was also really sad, like, was anybody else really sad with the son? Like, I don't know, I don't, I don't like seeing kids in comas and all that, like, it made me really sad, so... It was, like, weird. I also kind of think, like, why did they have the middle son, or the older son, um, why did they have him in the movie? Like, he wasn't really necessary to anything. Neither was the baby, but I guess to add, like, another, I don't know, it just was weird. Like, he had nothing to do with anything. Yeah, overall, I was very scared, and I'm still scared, and I hope I can sleep tonight. And I'll link below the creepy video of the creepy song, and that's it.